Hello and welcome to this video. I'm Omar and today I will show you how you can rename multiple files at once in Windows using Excel. This trick will help you to save a lot of time instead of renaming them one by one. And now let's go and see how we can do that. So let's say that I have these eight files for customers and my company started using a new CRM tool which generates some serial numbers. And I want to include these serial numbers in the names of the files that I have in front of me. So those are the old file names. And here are the new file names that I want to use. And as you can see, a serial number is added in front of each file. So how can I do that? Well, I can go to each one of these files and rename, then start renaming one by one. But this will take a lot of time from me to do it one by one, especially if I have, let's say, 100 files. So how can I do that at once? First, let me show you the way to do it for one and then to apply it to all. So I will type here CMD and here I can rename any file in this folder. As you can see, the destination is users, Omar Hamid, desktop, customers, which is the folder of customers here. So let's say that I want to rename the company info file. I will type REN, which stands for rename, space, open quotations, company info dot PDF, because it's a PDF file. Then I press space and the new name. I want the new name to be company information dot PDF. Close quotation. I press enter. And as you can see, company info is transformed into company information. And now how to do it for all the files. First, I will take the names of the new files from here. I will go into this new sheet of process that I prepared. And I will paste it here in the new names. Now I need to get the old names. How to do it? I will go again to the folder. And from here, I will type dir space forward slash b. Press enter and here I have the names of all the files in addition to their extension. For example, .pdf, .txt, .png and so on. I selected them, I will press Ctrl C, I will copy them. Then I will go to my Excel sheet and I will paste them in the column of old names plus extension. So here I have the old names now. I want to extract the extension from them. Now to get the extension, I will copy these. I will paste them in the extension here. So I will select these. I will go into Find and Select. And choose Replace. And here in the Find and Replace, I will replace the asterisk sign full stop with a full stop. What this means, it means that it will remove everything before the full stop which is the dot here for example dot pdf dot txt it will move everything before it and keep just what's after it and i will press replace all so here you can see now i have just the extension in this column now i want the new name plus extension so i press equals new name and extension and I will do it for all now I will put quotation marks here also apply it for all and here I will choose new names plus extension plus quotation marks so equals first 
a quotation mark then the new name plus extension and then again a quotation mark now press enter also apply it for all so here I have all of them with quotation marks now now all names with quotation marks so equals quotation mark and I will go the old name plus extension then again quotation mark I press enter and also apply it for all now I want to have ren word for all a space and I will apply it for all and now the final code so what is the final code it's equal to ren and space and old name with the extension and the quotation marks and space again and the new name of course with the extension and the quotation marks and I will press enter now I will apply it for all so as you can see now I have the full code so I, I will copy this control C then I will go to the command here again I will press Ctrl V and press enter and as you can see now all the files are renamed just in one step I hope this video was helpful for you to let you rename multiple files at once and save a lot of time instead of doing it one by one and wasting sometimes hours to do it don't forget to like and share this video and to subscribe to my channel to always support the content that I'm making.